welcome to vlogmas day three so today i am not doing a regular vlogging day i am actually doing a sit down video for you guys Before I start the video, with all the ideas, I wanted to let you guys know that I have made some categories and I will list the categories here in the times. So if you don't want to watch the full video and you just want specific ideas, I have listed them for you guys, as I just said, and you can skip to those times for those ideas. So for the first category, I have electronics. The second category is clothing and shoes. The third category is like beauty products, which is like skincare, makeup, hair care, and just like any body care type products. And for the last category, I actually have is miscellaneous items. So it's just a bunch of random items that are not included in the other categories. So without further ado, let's just get into the first category. So for the first category, it's electronics. For the first item in mind is actually an iPad from Apple. iPads can just do so much. I feel like you can take, you can like take notes, you can draw, you can play games, you can do social media, like you can take pictures. Like there's so much you can do with an iPad that I think people just like don't realize and don't think it's like a need because it's kind of like a bigger version of a phone just without service so but i definitely would recommend an ipad another electronic idea is a imac so with imacs yes you can't really like bring those places like you can with like macbooks but i definitely would recommend to the next electronic is actually airpods and their new like airpod headphones you could just ask for like the regular like plain ones that came out like a couple years ago or you can ask for these airpods headphones that are pretty new but they are more expensive the last electronic idea is obviously iphones a phone as you all know, the iPhone 14 from Apple actually just came out not that long ago. So I definitely would recommend asking for one of those if you want a new phone. That is my last electronic. So I hope you guys liked the electronic recommendations. The next category is clothes and shoes. Now, if you don't know who I am, I'm Whitney and I'm obsessed. When I say obsessed, I am obsessed with clothes, with taking pictures, new outfits, new style, new everything, resulting in clothing and shoes. Now, do I have a lot of shoes and clothes? No, because I am a broke mother ever who is in college and doesn't have any clothes. So the first idea for clothing is actually gift cards. Now when it comes to clothing and parents and everyone picking out that exact like shirt or sweatpants or clothing item sometimes they pick some things that aren't really your style so sometimes it's actually easier to just ask for a gift card from like american eagle or lululemon or nike or adidas depending on like what your style is you can just ask for a gift card from the store so you actually can just go and get the clothes yourself. So the first item is tops. Since it's Christmas, it's like the cold weather season. Sweaters, cardigans, coats, jackets are very in. And when I say coats, I'm not meaning like the winter coats that you put on because it's so cold outside. I'm meaning like the fashion coats. And I'm gonna put one here that I have recently discovered that is very cute. It's from Aloe. It's like 
this long fluffy like cute looking thing and it could be like a staple for your winter outfit i definitely recommend oversized sweatshirts because they are just so cute and when you want to be cute and comfy in your leggings and your fuzzy socks with your little coffee mug in your hand staring at the fireplace and christmas tree you want an oversized sweatshirt not a sweatshirt that is gonna suffocate you buying basic items is boring and you just want to go get the hot pink shirt on the other side of the store you still also should get basics because more than likely you're gonna get that hot pink shirt and wear it once and never wear it again but you're gonna get that basic t-shirt that's in black or nude and wear it about every single day because that's what I do. I, I'm the girl that's like, ooh, I'm gonna get that light or blind green tank top over there and never wear it. Literally, it's sitting in my closet and I think I've worn it once for pictures. You just need basics in your closet. And once you have basics, then you can go get that $50 hot pink t-shirt that you're gonna wear once. So for bottoms, I just recommend jeans, sweatpants, leggings, Lululemon leggings, aloe leggings, literally anything from Lululemon. I recommend to you, as an idea, if you want clothing, ask for a specific item that you are in love with, not an item that you're in like with. Now, after my pro tip of clothing, let's get into shoes. I just recommend knee-high boots, boots in general, Uggs, Air Forces, and Jordans, and Crocs or Slides. This category as a whole is beauty products. Now we're going to break it down to skincare, makeup, hair care, and then just body care. So we're going to start with skincare since it's pretty short and I care about it, but not really. I definitely recommend it figuring out what skin you have and asking for a product that's going to work for your skin for a cleanser. And then the next thing in skincare that I would suggest asking for is like a treatment, a treatment that is meant for your skin. So after cleansers and treatments and serums and face masks and pimple patches, another good skincare recommendation is moisturizers. Again, with moisturizers, I 10 out of 10 recommend getting moisturizers in your skin. From the skincare category, I would just suggest those items. And now on to makeup. Makeup is a lot. So some ideas in makeup that you can ask for is limp, lip plumper. There's this Sephora one that has been going around that I have seen and that I actually want to get and try because apparently it, looks, it works really well. I would also recommend lip oil. I actually currently have the Ulta Beauty and the Morphe 2. And let me just say, those are the best lip oils I have tried. They are life-changing and they always make my lips look so good. So I definitely recommend asking for lip oil, lip plumper. I would also ask for the Rare Beauty blush or highlighter. I've heard so many good things about the Kosas concealer. But the downside to asking for concealer is also making sure to tell the person you're asking to get you concealer is your shade. And if you don't really know your shade, I suggest not asking for it. But if you know your shade, girl, get you some concealer. So to end up the beauty product idea area category thing, we are going to start with the Dyson Air Wrap. If you don't know what that is, you are out of this world. You are not living. You need to ask for this item. Not tomorrow, not next year, today. Text your parent right now and ask for this product. The last and final category of this five hour video just kidding just kidding 
For the last category, it's the miscellaneous category where I just name off a bunch of ideas that do or don't fit into the other categories. So to start off this category, if you love coffee, get this coffee machine. It's from Nespresso. If you are a Starbucks stan, you can actually get some of a Starbucks sauces on Amazon for a, a pretty price. But if you're a stan like me, that's an idea. Or another idea is to get Starbucks cups. Next item on this list is blankets. Of course, who doesn't love blankets? There's so many sizes, colors, styles, things, everything about blankets. And blankets are a woman's best friend. The next item is to ask for Casetify phone cases. They are the most adorable and cutest cases ever. And let's just say they also actually protect your phone. What? Who would have ever thought your case could actually be cute and durable at the same time? I would have never thought either. But here we are. So I recommend Caseify phone cases. Next is you can ask for Laneige lip sleeping mask thing. Now, should I put a, should I probably put this in the beauty products? Yes. Did I? No. So am I telling you now? Yes. The last and final idea I have for you guys is candles. You guys are probably like candles. Candles to end off this video. Yes, candles. Candles are such a small item, but they smell so good. They make your room or your house smell amazing. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I am actually going to end today's wish list here. I have given you guys so many ideas, but my is my phone is actually going to die. It's like at 10% and I actually need to start editing this video so I can get it up to you guys tomorrow morning. So I'm going to end this video here and save you guys the time and energy from listening to me about a bunch of ideas that you guys need to get or that you guys should get but i hope these there's enough ideas for you guys enough specific and broad ranged ideas for you guys and i hope you guys enjoyed please do not forget to subscribe like and comment on this video and if you use any of these ideas in your wish list let me know down below and i will see you guys back with another video tomorrow for vlogmas day four Bye guys!